that I've got your speakers and your pumps. Everything organized and tucked in. And all the detail. A lot of great staging at this show already. Things that are right for that period of time and year. All of the original manuals over here. Old school radio. they have these mini trucks staged right next to each other together. It brings a whole new meaning to speaker box. <laughs> All right. I'm over here with the box under my bench seat in my truck. Look at this setup. Nice. I don't know if you can see all the glitter in the paint. The disco ball. Look at the crown. The front with the trucks over here we have poison ivy we got all the ivy on the bed We've got the name in the seat you can see the ivies all around the lift very cute so clean you know me and my love for bombs look at this I really like the display. It's just simple. Very like classic elegant. Oh, I like the rims too. The white walls. There's a lot of sparkle in the paint. And this is a first for me, the etching on the mirrors. That's really nice. And look on the sun visor too. Like the detailing with the etching, so much etching on this car, but in a good way, not in a bad way. Like it hits because it just adds with that gold paint. You're gonna see a lot of bombs on my vlog because this is this is my future. <laughs> but a merc. Steaming on this one too. All the Aztec in the props as well. Got the sundial over here. And there's just a little bit of glitter in the paint, just enough to make it pop. 
but not take away from the color. Flo down there, getting his details. Get this front end, look at this front end. Going back to the car hop days. Old movie theater speakers. Who remembers those? <laughs> you got that window tray. Saints. Really like the theming on this one. Got another really nice bomb over here. I keep over here we have mariposa, which you know means butterfly. And look at the butterflies here on the door, on the rose. A lot going on. You really just have to look at this car to find all the little details. Look at this pink Impala. Cali life. Look at that. All the details. I like how it's like chromed out, gray tone, black and white kind of feeling on the bottom. But then when you come up here on the top, you got all this color, it's popping. So it's like old school on the bottom, new school on the top. I like this color. And you got like the the trim has got a two-tone going on, gold, but chrome on the outside. I like that, something different. So much going on with the paint. Wow, 
guy. Look at this. At the end of the trim. All edged out. I like that. A little something something. Chrome on chrome on chrome. I like the color on this one. Purple's one of my favorite colors. This has a lot of gray, like undertones in it. So it makes it feel like smoky to me. I like it. I like the interior too. The pattern on the seats and the coloring. Indigenous Angel. I really like this color. I like this line going down the side, how it's like not a solid line. Brings a little texture to the car. I would say the vibe here in Long Beach, much more festive than we saw at Phoenix. We had a really good time in Phoenix. I'm just saying Long Beach is popping. A lot of people. I can. Yeah. Oh, look at this SS. This is nice. Over here we got sweet and sour. All kinds of things. We've got Aztec, we've got Whittier. So representing culture from a ancestry perspective and culture from a where you come from perspective. And I'm hoping you can see it. Look at that chandelier. Love it. And the visors, look at the paint on the visor. So much detail. And on the console inside. Look at this wagon. There's that seat I always talk about. The rear facing seat. The one all the kids in the family fight to sit in. I like this color. It's almost like it's got a lot of brown. But it feels like when I was walking up to it, more like a gunmetal. But when you get closer, you see this brown. I'm really enjoying this wagon. Close up of that bench seat. And I like the two-tone over here on the rear end. Another nice super sport over here. For those of us who have black cars, you know how hard it is to keep that black that clean. Got a lot of batteries going on here. Another car where the paint feels like smoky to me. I like the texture. Almost feel like it fades a little bit as it goes down. It gets darker. I don't know if that's just the lighting. You know, my eyes, but the top is black, but I feel like the car kind of is lighter in the middle and dark again on the bottom. Well, I like the interior on this one. Hit the back of this car so you can see that darker hood. Travel team.
light. I saw a white shot. Look at the door. All that itching. Now that's a rock. Lots of gold on the pumps. Oh, and I like the batteries. So coming back in from the hub, we had the media pass. We tried to get close. Uh, we kept getting denied by all the security. We saw the same happen with the other media. So everybody's got their arms in the air. We wouldn't have been able to get any quality content of the hub. We could only see it from the edges. So uh, we're not gonna have a lot of hub this time, but let's go get some more car footage. I'm trying to make sure I'm not getting in people's way. I'm messing with their experience. Look at the, look at the steering wheel. It's the art. <laughs> Got a disco ball. Over here. I like the top on this one. I've got idea to always mark this thing. We're in, like the paint on this one and the interior. It's like not over the top. Gives it a little character. It's bringing the color scheme in. I hope you can appreciate when the camera picks up. This one's well lit as it goes through the light cycle. 
Look at that color come to life in the light cycle. Once it gets that shine on it, nice. I love the sign, but I really like these roses. It's almost like lace in the paint. I like the detail. It's there. I like this icy blue color. Some of the details in the paint. Look at the handle. Just blends in with the mural. I like the how this truck has like the underglow effect up under the rail on the bed. And the clear plexiglass. All the boards have been taken out in the back. the suicide doors. I like the skirts on this one too. They're a little bit wider than some of the other ones that I've seen, but they're really adding to the profile of the car. All the detail under the hood. Look at those V's. Everything is etched on this one. I don't know the technical term, that's like the motor housing or the transfer case, but it's so, like, every bit. And even on the engine block, it's like crazy. On the trailer, on the bumper. And the tow truck is all blinged out. And he's towing another one. A little pink truck. Oh, look at the one with the patina. <laughs> Got a whole little town set up here. Cheech and Chong's Cannabis Company. <laughs> Liquor store that also has tacos. This club, Clique from Arizona, they have some of the cleanest cars. And look at his bike. The artwork on this bike is really cool. Watch when it comes around on the other side. And the sea.
This one has a lot of detail on the speaker housing. I think that's cool. So this one is absolutely eye-catching. The paint is deep blue. And the way the light's hitting it, it brings like that depth to it. He's gonna have you walk in. Observe some of these with me. It's so going a little fast. There's flow. There's just so, this is such a big show. There's so much to film here. See what's on these V's back here. Single pump. Another Continental. Ricky Man Boulevard. It's really hard to get some of these cars because it's so crowded. And I'm trying to be respectful of people and not hold up the line. I like the paint on this one. It's a really nice color. It's got those gray undertones. Oh, this is a nice wagon over here. We have the same pace, I swear. The line cleared out so I can try and get some more details on this wagon. There's a lot of sparkle in this paint. The mirrors are lighting it up nicely. Show how the color is different in different light. We've got the speakers. Trying to get those at least. There we go. And double pump. The Continental I was seeing from the other side. I don't know how to explain the color. It's not pink. It's not truly peach. I'm gonna call it champagne. Something different. The steering wheel reminds me of a hag. It reminds me of a leprechaun from the movie. I don't know if you saw the, I think it was a four leaf clover on the shifter or on the, uh, that's a brake actually. Let's come around for the handle. 
the dial. So this is the part I'm talking about on that band. You know, I always appreciate the trikes. We got a Disney themed bike with a sidecar. Watch this when it comes around. Nemo, Little Mermaid. Saw Moana. Fast and Furious theme. I like how long this bike is. Beach Cruiser. Nice truck. Team Purple. Got the suicide doors. That's a nice mural on the inside. The hood. Look at this light. <laughs> bad apple. <laughs> I said bad apple. It's bad plum. <laughs> Different. I like it. Come around on this one. <laughs> Got a lot of mini trucks in this section. I like how High Class puts all their cars next to each other, spaced out, lined up the same way. Shows that they come together. Oh, look at this. I like the glitter paint. This rose gold. Look at on the pumps, they have their name too. Club's name. All the rose gold is nice. clean car. And as you can see, high class just keeps going. <laughs> on the glass. Okay, that's Flo walking in front of me. 
I like that, the edge flat. <laughs> Look at the peanut. I'm an M's, I mean. shell. See everything's lit up inside. Sundance. That's a good name. Well, that's usually what many trucks call it, dancing. When they toss their bed, they call that dancing. from the other side. Here's the wife life car. But this is the one I want to see down here. This is for the person who wanted it all. They got a blower for the go fast. Low, low. And you can see in the back, all the speakers in the back window. Right top. Like what didn't they get? I love it.
of all of the different vendors and things that you can purchase while you're here. Shirts. Lowrider has their own booths. These are other booths besides the Lowrider booth. Rims. All different kinds of wheels. Cannabis. Now you're looking at the soul. Candles. <laughs> oh, I like the shoot. The van. Tattooing. So we have star work on clothing, stickers. Right now. Couple different tattooers. There's a whole, there's a few more. Lights. Lights that glow, lights with different colors, LEDs around the edges. Lots of different merch. It's pretty crowded, I can't even get through. One over here doing star shots. Yeah. Different backgrounds. Park to mine. Oh, I see something I want. They have some rose bandanas, so I gotta check it out. Some really pretty bandanas, mirrors. <laughs> Here's the lowrider booth. And I'll show you later on the other aisle. It was a great stand. They had really cool bandana work. I got a hair clip for me and the girls. My daughter and my son's girlfriend. So now we're on the next style over. It's a little bit wider, a little bit easier to get through. But there's all kinds of stuff here. More merch, steering wheels. Car collections. A lot of die cast model cars. Airbrush shirts, nice hats. Uh, I think pictures with models is my guess. Okay, I think we got one more aisle. Uh, got a lot of sarapes. Oh, nice. The lady lowriders taking pictures. That's dope. Original artwork on hats, bats, shirts, lanyards. Painters, House of Color. Oh, they bedazzle your Cortez's. Oh, this is clean. They bedazzle your Cortez. Fire. There's 
their website. Luxor wheels. Zoot suits. The girl. Mm -hmm. With their daughters. 